Hey guys, it's Matthew again with another amazing video, like always. Uh, it's me with John again. <laughs> We're actually headed up to Walmart. This video is going to be kind of a pool pond update. Uh, we've actually done a lot um, that I haven't really filmed. Yeah. But we've just, it hasn't, we've been doing a lot of little stuff over time. Um, but we're about to go and pick up some stuff from Walmart and I just kind of get it started. We'll show you guys where we've, what we've gotten the pool pond to currently and then we'll show what we're going to get it to, obviously. Yeah, we, got a, we got a plan for it tonight to be completely different from what it's going to be, so that'd be cool. Oh yeah. So anyway, it should be a pretty good video and yeah. Hey, what's up guys? So we just finished the Walmart run. Um, <laughs> as you can, <laughs> I'm just looking at my rear view. <laughs> but um, as rear you guys view? can see, huh? What rear view? Well, <laughs> <laughs> um, so as you guys can see, we have um, a giant pool in the back. Um, even though we already have one giant pool. So, don't really know why we fully bought another. <laughs> And we also got some river stones, which obviously you can't see <laughs> um, because of the giant blue thing. But anyway, so we got a giant pool. Um, our story is that was the only one they had and we're sticking to it. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, so we're pretty hyped to go home and get these things set up. And we're actually gonna go and look, uh, these are gonna be for our brim and whatnot, like our little tiny fish. But we're actually gonna go to PetSmart once we start draining the water off the other one out of the other pool just to kind of clean it up and everything we're gonna go and go to PetSmart and look at some other fish so cut that part of the video uh, we'll catch you guys there alrighty guys what's up so we made it back to his house safely and now it's time for the process we're gonna put well transfer over the fish from this pond yes I realize it is very very dirty sadly we're actually going to right now is we're gonna clean it out um, we're gonna put the fish that are in this pond into that one uh, We're gonna get everything set up and we're actually gonna use two of the filters from This like two of the air pumps from this side and put it into that one I said it'll have an equal distribution because right now that thing has so much water, air in it. It's good. It's perfect But we're gonna transfer the fish from there to there uh, fill that up with water with the rocks and then um, Filter out the water from that and drain it and that's gonna be more so the, like the predatory pond which is what i'm looking forward to Alrighty, guys so back with the process of getting the pond ready or pool pond ready um so far we have to pretty much hose off all the rocks we've already done that for this section that was one whole entire bag of rocks so that's actually it's pretty good pretty right? good to be Probably honest need one more yeah, so we've actually already washed it off. What we were doing, well, we didn't do it for the first one because we weren't really, well, we didn't really know what we were doing. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but we, we got it, like, we washed it off on the tarp, drained out the water, washed it off and whatnot about two or three times. Um, and we're cleaning them out pretty good just so that the pool pond isn't super murky. Yeah. But we're probably only going to put two bags of rocks in that little one. Uh, for the bigger pond over there, for the predator pond. We'll probably put three. Three, yeah. yeah, three or four. We got one left over, so I'll go out and buy two more. And the best part was, we almost made the uh, mistake of buying these tiny little bags of stones for like four ninety seven or something. Oh, like, it was like six bucks almost. Yeah, and we then we walked outside and found this giant pool. and With river, with pe river, river pebbles. pebbles. Yeah. What was that? Oh, no. <laughs> but um anyway so yeah we found those river beds and the river rocks were only like 397 for a giant bag yeah, so we were look at that ahead. bag yeah it's huge compared to the what we were gonna buy was like literally this big yeah it's maybe yeah it's like, what? But, <laughs> so we got the better deal to be honest with you but either way we're gonna get back to it and we'll catch you guys at the end of this pool pond video all right guys so we've already put the um, we put the stress coat in for the fish pool, pool pond video thing. Uh, <laughs> well, we already put the stress coat and everything so we can start filling it up and get ready to put our brim in and everything in a hot minute. Right now we're trying to get out some of the, you know, swirling things. The larger pieces yeah. of debris. So we're trying to get that out to get it as good looking as possible. It is going to be a little bit murky just because 
obviously we couldn't get all the dust and dirt particles off yeah. like we had wanted to. Well, that's but okay. that's yeah, that's all right. Um, we're going to be putting the fish in once it fills up a little bit more, and once we finish this pond, we're going to put the fish in, and that's probably going to be it for the first part. Well, I guess it's technically part two. Part two. But anyway, so, um, yeah, actually, I had a question for you guys. If you guys could do us a favor, what kind of things should, should we put in here with the brim? Other uh, than turtles, because... I don't want turtles running, running, roaming around this area. Or Plus lizards. don't eat the... Yeah, so no turtles, please. Or um, anything, but, yeah. anything that's a water breather. Yeah, and also, like, structure-wise. Because structure-wise is going to be important, too. Yeah, these, we don't have... This is a very small pool. Both of these pools are pretty small, so nothing huge. Yeah. Like, we need something... Like, I don't think we, we need can... We need a good do, size. Yeah, we don't... I don't think we can do, like, plants or anything. We can have plants in here. Well, it's a rock. Yeah, that's true. But anyway, guys, you guys let us know and leave comments down below and just tell us what you find out or really any ideas. But yeah, definitely let us know, you guys. Alrighty guys, so we actually finished up the uh, well the pond for what we wanted to get done today, and honestly, it's pretty good. We're prob we're about to go. Well, that'll be the next video that you guys will find out. But anyway, so while we finish it, it's right now. This is a temporary. You can kind of see all of our fish in there. They're hanging on the sides right now. They'll probably start to roam around eventually. Um, but once we get some more structures and everything, right now they're just you know not used to a new tank or anything. But that's it for right now. That's the update of the pool pond. Anyway, I hope you guys have a great day. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And leave a comment on what we should start to put in here with the uh, brim and whatnot. Um, that is gonna, this is going to be our predatory pond. So kind of do stuff that's kind of cool looking and not nothing that's going to kill the fish. But anyway, I hope you guys have a great day. Stay awesome. Like, comment, and subscribe. And y'all stay tuned for the next video.